Welcome to Art Talks with Tots. I am Melissa Katzen, the Manager of Family Programs at the High Museum of Art. Today, we will be looking at Boa masks. The Boa people live in the African countries of Mali and Burkina Faso and have grand performances where they wear masks. These performances take place between the months of March and May, which is their dry season, meaning it doesn't rain very often. The masks they wear are made from one big piece of wood and are meant to protect the person who wears the mask. Sometimes, bois masks depict animals. Let's look closely at butterfly mask. How is this mask similar to a butterfly? Can you move your arms like a butterfly? Bois masks usually have geometric shapes like circles, squares, and triangles. Can you find the circles in butterfly mask? There's so many that it's hard to count all of them. Together, let's count the six big circles on the wings. One, two, three, four, five, six. Do you see any other shapes? Now, let's look at hawk mask. What part of the mask make you think it's a hawk? Can you find the white wings on either side of the hawk's face? Trace the wings with your finger. What sound does a hawk make? Try making different bird sounds, like a hawk, a chicken, or a songbird. In the performances where the bois masks are worn, dancers also wear large costumes made from raffia fibers. Musicians will play flutes and drums, and people sing songs while the performer dances like the animal represented on their mask. How do you think the dancers move their bodies when wearing the masks in raffia outfits? Find a space in your home or outside where you can dance. Try dancing like a hawk or a butterfly or any other animal you can think of. Keep Toddler Thursday going. Make your own bois mask with our art activity and then have your own performance after reading dance-related books with our friends at the Fulton County Library System.